So I'm going to show you how to add these guided reading digital books into your Seesaw library. So first you're going to want to um, unzip the folder and then within each of these you have additional zipped folders. So I've already unzipped one but let's just show you again. Um, I can click on this and hit extract and it's going to ask to extract. And now when I open it, I'll be able to see the digital library. Okay, so here are all of the books. When I open that, um, it's going to give you these books, right? So those are PowerPoint images. We need to turn them into um, ping images or JPEG images. So that's a really easy step. It's just a little tedious. You're just going to hit File, Save As. And then um, you're going to want to change it to um, a ping image right down here. Okay, and save it. And it's going to ask you if you want to um, do every page. And I'm, yeah, I want to do every page. So I've done forest animals. And now I'm going to go ahead and do uh, my clothes. Um, I do have a shortcut that I use up at the top. So maybe you have that set up also. Um, but use that shortcut, save as a ping image. Yep, I want to do every page. Yep, I do. Um, and let me just do one more. So now you can see I have these folders, right? Let me just do one more. But this is what you would do for every book, okay? It's pretty simple. It's just like I said, it's tedious. All right, so this is step one. Let me just do one more book. All right, now that's done. I'm just going to head over to Seesaw. And I'm going to show you how to add this now into your library. All the things. Here we go. Log in. And I'm going to add a new activity. So here I am. I'm just going to go ahead and click on create a new activity. And I'm going to call this guided reading um, AA. And I've already forgotten one of the titles. So let's say um, My Toys. So right here is where I can put some directions if I wanted to, right? I can type in, read the page. I can give voice directions. Um, but I'm said I'm just going to go right down here and I'm going to upload an image. So you have your choices. You can do a Google file here. You can upload an image or you can do a, a video. So we need to add. Um, images. Um, I just happen to think, I think I have an easier way for you to do this. Okay. So, um, but let me go ahead and finish this. I just realized that you could do a PD, uh, a PDF and that would probably make it easy er for you. So I'm just bringing up in, um, another window. It's over here. Um, my guided reading, And um, my toys was the one I was working on. And I'm just going to be, you can put up to 10 pages at a time, just like this. So when I have them all in there. I'm going to click, um, I just selected them all and they're in order. Um, and then I'm going to do that. And now I have all of my book, my words in here. Okay. You may want to do some kind of prompting ahead of time. Um, so you can click down here. Um, read after me my toys and then you can go to the next page read after me my oh i gotta click the button read after me my train read after me my wag oh goy 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 read after me my wagon. And then maybe here you can say, now you read the rest of the book. And so they will read the rest of the book, right? And that's how you do it. So once you have it all done, you hit that yes button and then you want to save it and you are good to go. Hope that helps.